So if Steve Bannon being named to... <laughs> <laughs> oh my God! Laughter and scissors. Well, I just, I, you know, I don't even, I don't know how to even say it, you know. Yeah. Uh, but uh, if that wasn't enough this weekend, yeah. you know, he's now one of the heads in front of the Joint Chiefs of Staff. Mm -hmm. uh, he has no experience with uh, being uh, one of these people who's in front of everything. If that wasn't enough, uh, the White House is also under fire for leaving the word Jews out of their statement on Holocaust Remembrance Day. Now, they say it was intentional to be inclusive to all who were lost. But it's the Holocaust. Six million Jews <laughs> not mentioned. The and the Nazis weren't mentioned. It was like, you know, something went down, it yeah. was really bad, and we're really sorry, <laughs> and it's like... <laughs> the intention of the Holocaust was to wipe them away. You wipe cannot the Jews out. not yeah. mention them yeah. in remembrance, or you've done exactly what was supposed to happen. Well, they, you they know? feel, they, their, yeah. their position is a lot of Christians were killed, some political prisoners, gypsies, etc., were killed also, but... Them. The only group that was targeted specifically for their religion was the, the Jews. Jews. Yeah. So that is the, the reason for the Holocaust. The ha political prisoners were sort of on the sidelines there. And they picked up, of course, gays were also thrown yeah. in there. But it doesn't mean anyone and else you know, was not, because they weren't mentioned, doesn't mean it's not. like I. No, but you have to, you have to mention that because that's what the, the intention of yeah, Hitler no, was. Right. No, the I final mean, solution Jews. Yeah. was yeah. about the Jews. It doesn't mean no one else died. It just means well, the no. greatest but, sacrifice. But the idea, yeah. Yeah. that's right. Yeah. I mean, that's the, right. that... that uh, the head of Homeland Security supposedly ran a, a group called Breitbart mm -hmm. that was supposedly anti-Semitic. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, and I just don't... I mean, does no one... Uh, maybe they don't care. Maybe they don't care if it looks a little bizarre. Who's they? You know? Well, the White House. Okay. I mean, the White House, the, the president's son-in-law <laughs> is a Jewish man. Yeah, no. yep. right? His yeah. daughter, his daughter his converted. Daughter, his daughter converted. Daughter. So yeah. how do yeah. you, how do you leave out of the Holocaust? The school that, the that the kid goes the to, the, yeah. the yeah. Hebrew school that the kid goes to is against the ban. Also, well, yeah. Yeah. yeah, I mean, any but thinking you know, person. Sean Spicer um, oh. said that that Bannon um, is now on the National Security Council because he's a Navy, a former naval officer. He spent, um, he has a graduate degree, and he spent seven years in the Navy. I don't know if, right. if that makes him qualified, no. but that's the White House's. It's also we, oh, we have a veteran in our audience. Thank you for our service, your yeah. service rather. But yeah. she's shaking her head no. no. That doesn't matter though. No, that doesn't, that doesn't matter. matter. No. And the reason is that Steve Bannon is a political appointment. His job is a political appointee, and it's known that you don't want political appointees in those national yeah, security right. meetings because you don't want national security decisions to be based on politics. Oh, that's, yes. that's so right. conservatives had a problem when David Axelrod just sat in on some of those meetings. Mm -hmm. He didn't yeah. have a formal title, and it was with good reason. So I hope those same conservatives will now stand up and say, this guy should not be in those meetings. Well, let's see. Can we hear him? Yeah. I'm well, waiting. I, nice. I, I'm waiting. Hear him. I don't think it's a coincidence when he announced this, which yeah. was it was buried. It was well, buried you know, on the weekend. We were all looking a lot of somewhere stuff else. On Friday afternoon around four. <laughs> so we got to start watching his ass at Friday afternoon at four o'clock. Head <laughs> of Homeland Security who run the organization called Breitbart. I met Steve Bannon, Trump's chief strategist, and he did say uh, the Nazis, not the Jews. Have a great day. Take a little time to enjoy the view. <laughs>